Hi guys. Um, I don't know if you can see how pink I am. I'm pretty pink. And you know what's funny about that pink? Is that I wasn't pink like an hour ago. I uh, went to a parade today and we out went out in the sun. But it was kind of overcast. But I could feel the sun starting to get me. And then I went running. And about halfway in, my face started to burn really bad. And then my shoulders started to burn really bad. And then I realized that all the places that were just, just like this much shy of sunburn were starting to hurt. Because <laughs> apparently heating your body up will cause those areas to go ahead and like finish the job. So I've been really pink now. <laughs> like I'm, I'm sun-kissed from the gym. That's fun. I went ahead an amazing run, like seriously. And you know what it was? I think that as much as like I have this whole new roar, I can do anything. And I believe that I do. I'm still like blown away by what I can actually do. So like, I know I can push it. I know I can run. But just to really go for something, it's like a scary thing. But um, I went to the gym. It's been a long day. I've done a lot of driving and I'm tired because even though I did sleep last night after the Zoomathon, I was pretty wiped out. So, and we had a surprise. My daughter, thank God, is so good at remembering things and she remembered she had a project due and I forgot the paper. I mean, I lost the paper. So, I had to call, like, we don't have any of her little people's numbers, because we have kids from last year's numbers, but not kids from this year. So I went through the computer on the white pages, and I looked up every last name she could remember. And the thing is, people don't have house phones now. They have cell phones, and cell phones aren't listed. So I winded up finally finding somebody with a house phone and calling. They didn't answer the first time. An hour later, they answered. And she was so awesome. She um, made me a copy and everything. Oh, so awesome. So we did a project tonight and then I got to the gym and I was feeling very exhausted and I was like maybe I should just try and get me closer and closer. Um, I was like maybe I should just, uh, you know, not go or maybe I should just jog. I was like, you know what? If I can do three hours of Zumba, I can knock out a half an hour running. So I did. I ran 25 minutes. One minute to cool up, four minutes to cool down, and I ran. It was awesome. It was so cool. And you know what? All the things that I was worried about, not being able to do it, and like not being able to get through it, none of it happened. I just, I killed that. I killed that. Seriously. That treadmill's probably still crying. No. Okay, maybe it's not that seriously, but you know, like the whole idea of it is like, I did that, and that's awesome. Um, because the Hungry for More videos take more time to put together, because I like, I, like, I mean, I feel like they have a message, and so I actually want to spend some time on it. I don't want to just do this, this like rambling of nothingness, because I like to ramble of nothingness with you guys, because you guys are awesome. But, um, because of that, I haven't done one because it's been a crazy weekend, but it will be coming up. Um, what I'm going to be talking about in that video is habits and forming different ones, as I'm sure you have all figured out we need to do. Um, so, yeah. Just wanted to share the whole look. I'm sunburned from the gym, and the whole we can do anything we put our minds to. It. We can do anything. Seriously, I was on that treadmill and I was like three hours of Zumba. I'm gonna knock out half an, half an hour of running. I'm gonna run this. I'm not gonna make myself. I'm not gonna because I go with preset. Like I would like to run. This is how I've done it from the beginning, and it worked. So I'm not downing it, but I'm saying like there comes a time to let that go, which is with everything, you know. It's kind of like, um, like when I mentioned that girl using Lean Cuisines, I think that if that's how you can get yourself to eat healthier or portion control, awesome. And then eventually you need to start learning how to eat 
fresher foods. Okay. Or like, you know, if I say this all the time because people will be like, I can't drink water. I don't like water. <sighs> water really does taste different sometimes. And if you get like that Voss water in the glass bottle, it tastes awesome. Keep it really cold. And if that's, I mean, it's expensive, but if that'll get you drinking water and then you can switch out to something else. Buy bottled water so it's easy and convenient. And then once it's a habit, start worrying about the environment. Buy a bottle. Fill it up yourself. You know what I'm saying? So like this little trick that I did when I first started going to the gym totally worked. I'd be like, okay, today I'm going to run one mile. I'm going to make myself. And I would run the mile and then stop. Then the next time it was like, I'm going to run one mile, take a five minute break, and then run a half a mile. And those kind of things worked. But just running, just being like, you know what, I'm going to wing it. I'm going to do what I can has been a new experience and it's really awesome and what really is cool about it is it allows you to figure out how much more you're capable of and I mean I was just like my Zumba really like the Zumba thon really like lit a fire and it was like this is awesome this is killer so I went to the gym today and I was like I'm gonna do this and then it was like okay y'all seriously voices in my head right it was like a little cheerleading squad because it was like 80 pounds. Yeah, you right. I can run this half an hour. I can lose 80 pounds. And like, you know, like I'm running and running and it's like, you know, what are you doing this for? I'm doing this to lose more. What are you doing this for? I want to be healthy. Like a little whole, you know, I mean, it works. In my brain, there was a whole cheering section. And it was like a, it was a good moment, and I hope to have more of them. And you know what? I am, no, scratch it. I'm going to have more of them. No, I hope. I'm going to have more. And it's going to be awesome. And then I'm going to get on YouTube and tell you all about it, because that's fun. All right, guys. I've caught up on a couple of videos. I have to go watch some more. <sighs> I love your videos. I love keeping in touch. Through the videos, I love being a part of your journey, and I'm really glad y'all are a part of mine. Yay.